just overjoyed and really excited to take the stage, um, honored. And um, now that I'm here, it just feels really surreal. <laughs> I think being on the grounds and having Windsor Castle as your backdrop is a dream. I'm singing a song called Reflections from Mulan, a Disney song, and I feel literally like I'm a Disney princess on that stage. Um, yeah. Well, did you watch the coronation yesterday or see bits of it? I did. It, it's remarkable to me, you know, because we don't have that back in America to, to see it. And I particularly loved his prayer. Um, I'm a strong woman of faith, and I thought the prayer was really beautiful and um, full of service and grace, and um, I loved that part, and it was crazy to see just the crown and everything. It, it was amazing. I mean, we're certainly, you know, not old enough to have that. Um, actually, I'm part Hawaiian, so I believe our state is the last state who had their, uh, was the only last state to have a monarchy. There. So um, we had our late Queen Lilio Kulani, who was our last queen that I really truly admire and look up to as a beautiful songwriter and musician. So um, we had that. So when I go home to Hawaii, we have that Iolani Palace and everything. But um, yeah, so it's very special. Like my friends and family are, we're all freaking out that I'm here. <laughs> well, just one last question. Um, if you, whenever you meet the, queen, the king tonight, have you thought about what you might say to him? I don't know. Um, maybe something about the song, because I'm singing a song called Reflections, and um, I really relate to the song, and I hope, I think a lot of people out there will relate to it too, and even he will, so.